Hi, welcome to Lessons with John. Uh, today we're going to try Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. It's also the alphabet song, so you can use it for that too. Uh, G, 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 C, C, G, C, C, G, G, D7, back to G. G to D7, G to D7, G to D7, G to D7, G, 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 C. Alright, G chord. You can use any G chord you like. Uh, the one that I was playing was the 6th string 3rd fret, 5th string 2nd fret, 1st string 3rd fret. Okay? Uh, the one that may show up on your screen, because I see it's the one on my piece of paper here, is the simplest of all Gs. In case you don't know it, 6th string 3rd fret, 1st string 3rd fret, you just lean over a little bit so the 5th string gets muted. That's like the easiest G chord. So that's the way I'll teach like beginners, uh, you know, elementary school kids and stuff. G's hard for them to reach small hands. Alright, uh, you could also use the G chord where you're using the two fingers on top. That's a very popular one too. That one will work too. Any G chord's fine. Uh, C chord, 5th string 2nd fret, 4th string, uh, no, 5th string 3rd fret, 4th string 2nd fret, 2nd string 1st fret. That's your C chord. Then D7. Leave your finger on the 2nd uh, string 1st fret, 3rd string 2nd fret, 1st string 2nd fret. I'm going to mute the 6th string. That's my D7 chord. Uh, if you don't like that and you want to play a regular D chord, that would be fine too. D7 is just like a substitute uh, for D anyway, so that would be fine. Okay? So the, this song has like, all I'm doing for a, a stroke, by the way, is just, just all downs. Just my thumb, you can use a pick, whatever. Something simple like that. Uh, so you're, there's like two sections to the song. There's like the big section, the, the G, 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 and then C, G, C, G, D7, back to G. So that's your main section. That comes back later on, so it's, it's a way to, you know, memorize it uh, quickly by doing it when, you know, using the patterns, the architecture of the song, you know. So that section is, uh, you do the G chord for a whole measure, so it's four times, and then the C twice, G twice, C twice, G twice, D seven twice, G twice, and then uh, then it's the, the next section is the up above, uh, so G twice, D seven, G, D seven, and then that just repeats, G, D seven like a diamond, G in the skies, D, uh, D seven, so each one of those chords was just two times. So that section's like G, G, D7, G, G, D7 twice. Each chord just twice, just back and forth between the two chords. Then that main section comes back, the G, G for four times, C twice, G twice, C twice, G twice, D7 twice, and then you can just hit the G at the end once if you want. All right. That's it. That's all there is to it. Uh, you could use it for the ABC song. The you know, A, B, C, D, C to G, uh, C to G, D7 back to G. Don't get confused because I'm not singing the letters. <laughs> uh, pretty easy though, right? And then, and then G, G, you know your ABCs. C to G, C next time G, won't you D7 with me? Pretty simple. I'm sure you can catch on to that. Uh, please subscribe, hit the like button, thanks for watching, and play more guitar.